Hi my lovelies, I hope you're all well. So just a very quick video today. We're seeing lots of reports that people are not getting the new features from beta 7.20 and there's a couple of reasons why this might be why you're not getting the update and you're then not seeing the new features such as unite subtract intersect and exclude as well as being able to rename your layers so the most likely reason is that you're not set to beta so there's a couple of ways that you can set yourself to beta if we come up to the settings bar and we go to settings, you'll see we've got design space settings and under general, we've got application experience. If you are set to live, then you want to change it across to beta. These new features are only going to be available for the time being on desktop and beta. So you must be on desktop, so that could be Windows or Mac and you must have your design space settings set to beta. Now, if you are not seeing this, it probably means that you have not updated in a really long time. So the best thing to do in that instance is to uninstall design space. So you want to uninstall it from your desktop. You then want to go to design.cricket.com that's design.cricket.com and you can then download the latest version of Design Space for either your Mac or your Windows and it will then download the latest version so that you can then toggle between live and beta. It's always worth checking out the system requirements for Design Space. It could be in the worst case scenario that your system is actually not able to have the new version of design space or to have the new features under beta so if you download design space and you're still not getting that toggle it's worth coming in to help.cricket.com and then checking out the requirements for design space so Windows, you want to be a minimum of Windows 10 or later and then there's other requirements in there and Mac, you want to be Mac OS 11 or later. And again, there's requirements in there as well. But if you meet either of those requirements for Windows or Mac, and if you're not getting the live or beta toggle, you can uninstall Design Space, reinstall it. It will give you the latest version. You can then toggle across to beta and it will come up with the install for beta 7.20 and you'll then see those new features. Hopefully this has been helpful. If you've got any comments or questions, please do leave them below. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell and I'll see you all again very soon. Bye.